Nate Booker coming in at 130 pounds, height of 5 feet 8 inches, kickboxing record 7 and 2, uh, fighting out of swift kick, got a Muay Thai and kickboxing fighting style. Kickboxing fight. Tennessee with the Warriors Den. He's weighed in at 135. He's five feet nine inches tall and he's got a kickboxing record of 0 and 1. He's got a boxing fighting style and uh, I think he's got something to prove with this fight. He's gonna come out and really try to try to improve his record. And uh, but he's gonna have a really Hard fight against him with a guy seven and two. Yeah, these guys are really experienced in here. Todd Murray, the third guy in the cage. Round one. Let's go. Isaiah is really coming out hard. Hey, with a hard right. Isaiah, Isaiah coming really out putting strong. pressure on him. Low kick by Nate. Isaiah's really putting the pressure on, but Nate's not letting him have an inch. I mean, he's really... Low kick by Nate Booker. Keeping his legs working. Isaiah with those straight legs, and it's going to play on his cardio for sure. Todd Murray having to stay, you know, keep running. These guys are so quick. Isaiah is really putting that pressure on him, keeping Nate moving, but Nate's likewise. I mean, he's, he's making it follow him for sure. Nate's definitely calm and collective. He's got the he's working on the legs leg kicks and he's trying to uh, keep that working for, for him in the later rounds if this goes that far. Yeah. Isaiah's definitely got a really, really heavy right hand. And I mean if he if he connects, it's gonna be some detrimental, but Isaiah's not giving it to him though. Isaiah's doing the right thing right now. He's circling away from that power hand. Yeah. Keeps using those straight kicks. It's wow. a good first round. Definitely a good first round. I think they're testing the waters a little bit. Yeah. Um, Isaiah was just pressure, pressure, pressure. Mm -hmm. um, I don't know if that was part of his training for this fight, but um, it's definitely working for him so far. Yeah, I feel like Swift Kick, they've got just, they do that Muay Thai, and I feel like they're really laser focused in on that, you know, and whereas I, I feel like you can see a lot of those leg kicks coming out, a lot of that. Definitely. I mean, all the swift kick guys so far have been just leg kick masters, it seems, yeah. and it's really it's really paid off for them in the, yeah. in the later rounds because, you know, it limits the mobility of the other fighters. Both fighters right now looking pretty, pretty all right, but we'll see, uh, see how some of those body shots play effect on uh, Isaiah. Even with these pads on, on the shin guards, these kicks still yeah. hurt. Yeah. I mean, they still take it out of you in the muscle. Yeah. 
Slam of the cage door. <laughs> Keeping him in. Here we go, round two. Definitely come oh my God. Isaiah, Isaiah clipped him with the right hand. hand. Isaiah's keeping that pressure on him, but it seems like uh, Isaiah laid in a hard right, man, but uh, Nate did not let him have it. I believe Nate still has his bearings about him, so yeah. I think he's doing yeah, he's all right. Definitely. He just got him with a hard knee to the body. Isaiah's rocked. Fall is a great exchange. Leg kick for Isaiah. Nate sneaking in that jab. Knees on the inside for Nate. Those knees to Isaiah are really doing it. I'm running. Got a great right hand, but or Isaiah, I'm sorry, has an amazing Isaiah right hand. Isaiah catches him again yeah. with the right hand. Nate seems like he's definitely doing good at counter striking with uh, with everything Isaiah's got. Knees to the body for Nate. Definitely gonna play dividends. Yeah. Especially these later rounds, man. Pace is definitely slowed at the end of the second round. Yeah. From yeah, just sure. the amount of strikes these guys are throwing. Yeah. <laughs> Heard a lot about Nate stealing some cookies. Still some cookies for sure in that round. <laughs> some cookies were stolen and some milk was spilled. Yeah, yeah. There was definitely some spilled milk. But you know, I feel like that definitely changed. I feel like Nate came out, like, showed it a little bit better in that round, and I don't know, it's a really close, close fight thus far. Both fighters look pretty uh, worn out right now. Um, I think this might be a slower paced round. Yeah. But Isaiah, we'll see. Yeah. I mean, it's really anybody's fire right now. If Isaiah keeps landing some of those hard rights that he's been hitting with, that's uh, that's everything. And then Nate's been putting some really good knees through this whole fight. So let's see how, how much that's gassed out Isaiah. I believe that both fighters have respectively landed, landed um, you know, their different uh, strikes. You have Isaiah landing the, the strikes with the head. And then you have uh, Nate landing strikes to the legs and then to the body. Yeah. And I think that it's going to be a hard fight to judge. Yeah, for sure. Third round. I think we're going to be coming in strong here. Like Nate is going to definitely come in. Uh, come in swinging on this one. Making sure those fighters are stuck in this cage. No There's jumping out, fellas. No escape, no escape. All right, here we go. Isaiah comes Isaiah. out hard. Isaiah catching that knee. Staying on the outside, picking his shots. Just holding. Can't hold. Isaiah keeps trying to come in, and Nate keeps doing that kick in. Really taking away his Nate offense. with a nice counter left hook. Isaiah with the right hand. Isaiah's been laying a lot of significant strikes, but Nate doesn't look face. Oh, 
they both definitely seem to have their bearings about them. Yeah. Despite all the shots being landed. They're definitely picking their shots a lot more in this third round now. I don't know if that's their winded or... He's totally dropping his guard. I mean, you can definitely tell that Isaiah's side. Leg kick on the outside for Isaiah. He's working on that lead hard. leg of Nate. Those are horribly hard leg kicks. And I actually think those leg kicks from Isaiah are uh, limiting the mobility of Nate. He's definitely slowed down a lot after yeah. those. Yeah. He's not quite picking those legs up as much as he was. Going to break them up. Ten seconds. Final ten seconds. Oh. oh. And that's it right there. I'm not sure how much time is left in this last round. They're putting the headgear back on. <laughs> he said, I don't need no headgear. He was know, ready he was to going keep going. going. He didn't need it. That was, uh... These kids in here are just tough as nails. Nice little rest yeah. for these fighters, even though there's a, such a short time left. But um, The last two fights, they've had some problems with the, that headgear. Time in. Here we go. Mm. It's going to be a hard one to score, man. The fight is over. I feel like Isaiah landed a whole lot of really significant head strikes for sure yeah um his his right hand was just on point tonight for him he was landing it consistently and really flush yeah and man for seriously this is second fight that is uh that was a great second fight man and I, nate's fought this is uh it's going on his 10th fight right now so i mean sky's the limit for isaiah i feel like we'll see him again for sure and i feel like he's just going to keep improving for sure i can't wait till a lot of these uh fighters actually get to go uh mma yeah and put put all of their combinations together with wrestling and striking and it's just going to be amazing to see these guys evolve but as far as this fight goes i don't even know how to call this fight yeah you know, it's cool. I, I was talking to Jose about this uh, yesterday, and uh, he said Isaiah is a relatively newer to their gym, and uh, he's just significantly improved for the last just few months that he's been fighting. I think he's only been fighting for just a little while. This is the same guy I'm talking about. He's definitely got the power yeah. behind his punches. All he needs to do is learn a little bit more technique or a little bit more movement, and yeah. he's going to be a dangerous fighter. That is for sure. And Nate, on the other hand, on the opposite spectrum, he has so much technique, yeah. so much speed. He was moving around. Um, Randy Looney with our decision here. Isaiah Wall takes this fight tonight with a nice win against a much more experienced opponent, probably. Yeah, I mean, that's a huge victory for him right there. 